Hello everyone and welcome back to Streaming Sundays. Today is August 19th, 2018 and you are watching Graveyard Keeper which was provided to me for free from the developers. A link is in the video description if you want to check this out on Steam. But I did get it for free. Graveyard Keeper is made by Tiny Build, which is the same company that published Punch Club, in case you uh, are aware of them. I'm going to try to say hi to everyone in the chat, but we've been streaming for 45 minutes while everything's been going wrong on my end, so I don't know who's here and who's not. So, at least based on the chat, hello TC, hello Kaylin, hello Ryu D, hello Cosmic Phoenix, hello KJ Friend, hello Cam! I... Were you... Have you been here all day? I didn't see many chat messages from you earlier. Hello, Tofa. Hello, uh, Kalo is here. Hello, Lord Arios. Hello, Polar Dread. Hello, Cosmic Phoenix. And hello, Jinergy. I believe that's everybody who is chatting. If I missed anyone, I apologize. Hello, Chibi Girl. Did I say hi? I think I said hi. Boy, I cannot remember anyone that I... Okay, anyway... If you are attending, if you are not attending the stream live, if you're watching this from the archive, you should join us every Sunday at 4 p.m., especially because we've added some new Nightbot commands where people can pull quotes of me or whatever, Jeez, say them out of context. The chat's freaking moving today. The chat is, well, this is because we got a hi, Tofa, and this is because we got a lot of awesome people who are chatting. I said hi to Cosmic Phoenix twice. God damn, my short term memory is so bad, I forgot how this sentence started. So, we are playing Graveyard Keeper. If you don't know anything about it, it's a tongue-in-cheek management game set in medieval times. And other than that, I don't know anything about it because I forgot to pre-play it this week. Oh. Like I tried to do. Yes, the Akamura. Ryu wants us to Mamba to do the Mamba Demon video. Mamba? Oh, yeah. We gotta dub it over, Mamba. Yes. I still need to get with him. And f uh, it is an ordinary day and our hero is hurrying home. We're so... All Something right. very important is waiting for him. Even in everyday routine, there is a place for lo loving and feeling loved. Hi, Gary. Especially when you know that someone misses you. That's another thing that bothers me when text auto advances. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Wow, didn't expect that to be so loud. Hope I didn't blow out anyone's ears. Let's uh turn that shit down a little bit. Calm down, you've merely turned a page in your life. Look at my glorious beard. A new, a whole new chapter awaits you ahead. <laughs> but I need to go home. Can I go home? Maybe you should take Dath. You be Dath. There's always a way to get home. Hmm, let me see. Your new home is a graveyard. Does that mean I'm dead? It means you're a graveyard keeper now. Well, that sounds so much more agreeable. But I need to go home to my love. She's a Momiji body pillow. No one quote that. Then you need to be a good graveyard keeper. Hooray. I need to get a vanilla Coke is what I need. You should dig up G Gary. He'll help you sort everything out. Take my last one? I think so. Here. Oh, go ahead and finish it. No, that's fine. I'll stick with water. Okay. What a strange vision. What is this nightmare? Okay, let's find Gary. Or is uh, that Jerry? Because, like, the cashier was cool. Gary. Yeah, I don't know. All right. Well, Probably keys grilling are keppers good. in the back. Walking in the shit. Beautiful house. No toilets, but that's fine. That's what the fireplace is for. One star. Okay. Yes, it looks very Harvest Moony. Let's go follow the arrow. Well, that's a problem. I I hit F. What do you... Oh, I have to hold it. I, yeah, okay. Wow, this is very punch clubby. Holy sard! Oh, that's a different voice. I'm a... Holy sard! I'm a skull! <laughs> what? Why would you think I'm Jerry? I like that voice of yours. A man with a red eye told me that I need to dig up Jerry Gary. Also... A red eye. I remember. Oh, Sard, that's right. I'm Jerry. How did you find me? Why is that causing your volume to spike? A man told me that you'd answer all my questions. Good, good. But first, let me ask you, who are you and where the sod are we? Uh, I use a lot of air in that one. 
Good question. I must be dreaming. None of this can be real. What? Ugh. Ugh, you're the new graveyard keeper. Again, this is why l the lack of auto advance. Oh, what else do I remember? Let me think. Every text needs to be manually advanced. I remember that sound. Let's go check it out. If it's not voice acted. I love that voice of yours, even though they don't know where that came from. S everything is so strict. You know, I think it'll be better if I wait for you here. I'm mean, scared of the poor thing. I definitely remember a bell. And a donkey. Uh... All right. Something's very wrong with that animal. Yeah, yeah, we'll... S Could be dangerous. Why am I walking in everything? <laughs> Got a fresh corpse from the town. Is that the donkey talking? It is. Wow! A talking donkey. Okay, I can't advance the tax. That's good. You you can understand me. Let's talk. Who are you? I'm cheap labor. This cart isn't mine, so I have to work for the capitalist bastard who owns it. And I only earn five carrots a day. I'm going to turn down the game audio just a smidge. That is a wee bit loud. This situation is deeply humiliating. You know where I'm coming from, right, comrade? Comrade, yes, comrade. Oh. Tell us more. Okay, it's a Russian donkey. The bastard pretends that he doesn't say it, doesn't understand anything I'm saying. Anyway, I need to go back to the town. You get rid of this one, I'll bring you a new one. What a strange land this is. Um, if uh, you guys have done right. Beast Tribe quests, that's the voice I use when I'm voicing Baco. Hey! What are you staring at? Uh, I feel like we should take it to the morgue. I don't remember why exactly. I mean, it's a body. But I'm pretty sure it'll be fun. And it might be profitable. Polar Dread wants me to punch the dinky. <laughs> Sounds legit. All right. Let's do it. The body is apparently decomposing right now, so let's take this. Oh, j wait, really? And just quit. All right. We can just. Cool. I don't. I don't need to carry this shit. Oh, yeah, I guess do. I do need to carry this shit. Okay. Oh, God damn. Stop moving. All right. That's better. Jeez. Sod. I like this place. Feels like home. Put the body on the autopsy table. Then what's next? Oh yes. Slice some flesh from the corpse. That should be good for starters. What? No way. This isn't right. Sure, sure, it's not right. How could I forget? Maybe because I'm a talking skull with amnesia. I mean, you don't have a brain. Is it right you don't know where you are? Is it right that I'm a skull? Nothing is right here! So shut the sod up and do what I tell you! Uh, you'll promise you'll tell me how to get home after that? You just need to trade the meat in the village tavern for a beer. Talking skulls never lie. And then bring the beer to me. How are you going to drink it with no tongue or body? Okay, let's go extract some flesh. Chunk. And autopsy and body parts. Okay. Extract flesh. Sure. Hold F to work. Boy, if only it was that easy in real life. I've got a new technology and can create a burger, sandwich, or bake some meat with human flesh. This is gross. You'll get used to it. What should I do with the corpse? I don't know. Let's bury it. Take the corpse. I'll wait for you in the graveyard. Uh, okay. Take body. I, I'm so glad they went with, you know, this kind of graphic style, so it's not nearly as great. What the fuck? PD oh. says, I think that skull needs Skeletor's voice. No, we're already doing Baco! What do you want, Jerry? Let's bury it! Use the blueprint desk at the graveyard. Mark a site for the grave, then dig it with your shovel. Carefully put the body in the grave. Bury, decorate. Warning, do not use goat skulls and upside-down scars for decoration. How about we use some ghost skulls and upside down stars for decoration? Let's see, where do I... Let's just chuck that shit there for a second. Okay. So we need a grave site. Uh, we'll, do, 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 well, we'll put it near the gate since we don't have too many. Whatever. Cool. All right, we'll just grab that shit. And huzzah! Oh, god damn it. Get, get, get out of my way. All right. 
Boy, I hope no one uh, sees diggy, me diggy, desecrating Diggy, 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 diggy hole. And haboosh. Cool. Awesome. I'm a novice Nicely grave digger. done. Oh, this burial certificate. I remember money, alcohol, alcohol. I sure used to like it a lot. Oh, sod, here comes the bishop. He's your boss. Great. Oh, oh, I know. Ask him about this burial certificate. He should know something. I better leave now. I'll be in the morgue waiting for my beer. Right. Dear me, why am I so tired? Why? Why do I have to come here every week? That whoa. Ha, the keeper you are. There you are. Hmm. Look at my eyebrows. I'm sorry to have to tell you this, but your graveyard is a mess. There is no way I'm promoting you to cleric until you fix it. Uh, okay. Got it. As soon as your graveyard is at least five skulls, I'll be pleased to promote you. You look like a spiritual leader, and I'm a good judge of character. <laughs> I'm good at everything. That's why I was chosen to represent his will. <laughs> Your predecessor used to keep his stuff in a trunk somewhere here. You should check it. I'll come by again next week. In fact, I come here every day, I guess. Maybe I'm not dreaming. Did I eat something? No, oh, he's waiting. What should I say? Uh, why is it you come here? It's part of my duty, the unpleasant part. It's kind of an old tradition. I don't know much about all the traditions and rituals. I'm just here to represent his mighty and might and glory. <laughs> I have one tiny question. What is this burial certificate? As soon as a body has been laid to rest, you can trade its burial certificate for money at the village tavern. All right. Uh... I was going home from work, and I need to go home. There's a talking skull. He forced me to butcher a corpse. Ha <laughs> ha, fine joke. I'm a humorist myself. Here's one. Who is BB? Who? I am. Ha <laughs> ha, what? Blessed and be... Can we dump his body somewhere? Because, uh... Laugh, get on his good side. Uh, it was funny. Uh, no, it wasn't. Ugh. All right. If you run out of repair kits, we'll fix in the graveyard and craft new ones. Great. Okay. Green, red. Uh huh. Handcrafting, knowledge, nature. Blue is spiritual knowledge. You earn points by simply doing anything. You can also get points from studying new items. Got it. Small rock. Got oh, hey, uh, I don't know shit. if you saw Kalen's quote there, but no. the phrase checkmate is derived from a Persian word meaning the king is dead. Yes, she taught me that today when I saw her stream. It was cool. Her stream, that is. I mean, the quote was interesting. The energy but asks, was cool. what happened to the predecessor? What do you think happened to the predecessor? Uh, I the guess... same thing that happens to all of us in the end. We retire. All right, so what am I doing here? I guess I'm repairing shit. So exuma body stone. Oh, I have to, I have to make repair kits, right? That's what's going on. I love how I asked, like, what do? Oh, let's see. Tab is not inventory. Tab is my everything. Oh, tab is my building stuff. Character. Here we go. Wood repair kit. Boop. Grab. I can't equip. Boy, maybe I should have paid more attention to what he was saying. So what am I doing here? How do I fix the graveyard? Just repair all the graves. It wouldn't even take me an hour, but it's your job. You should ask him about the graves or the death certificate too, because Jerry probably needs special in that resources for that. Repair graves to increase the graveyards overall. Whatever. About this certificate, can you tell me more? It is your payment for laying a brother under rest. It's all part of an ancient contract between the town and the village. As soon as a body has been laid to rest, you can trade its burial certificate for money at the village tavern. Oh god, this seems too complicated to be a dream. Uh, where is the village? Just go east from the graveyard gate along the old stone road. 
uh, about the town. The town is a, the heart of our glorious land. The palace, the cathedral, everything is there. You should see it for yourself. Uh, but in those clothes, that would be rather funny. <laughs> well, how can I get to the town? It's not far from the village. Just head south from the tavern. All right. Okay, so All I'm right. clearly um, miss missing something. Let's get Genergy this. says the skull traded his flesh for a beer, probably. Dead tree out of here. Oh, hey, we got some stuff. Okay, let's just Kaylin keep... says you don't need to equip your repair kits. You just walk up to them. It opens a new menu, and you choose actions from there. Oh, okay. Uh... Uh, 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 uh. All right. So, stone cross exhume. Like, there's no. Do I? Nope. Like, I am at the grave. Walk up to the grave that is not the repair kit. What? Walk up to the grave that is not a repair kit? I don't know what that means. Me either. Clarify, uh, I think please? she. I think she missed a comma. Let's see. Rusty axe. Da, da, da. So I have four wooden repair kits. Crafted at carpenter's workbench. Wooden stick. Burial certificate. Crafted at. Like I see where the things can be crafted at. Oh shit! It's. It's getting late. We are on a real-time clock here. You're also getting tired. Am I? Oh, that's what that is. For some reason, I thought that was like some sort of experience point bar. Uh, okay. So what am I doing here? Adds one Walked, point Walk up two. to a grave with wooden stuff. Oh, okay. So say this thing. Grave. Wooden cross... Adds a wooden cross. Study not complete, so I guess I can't do it. I don't know. R and E and... Well, R doesn't do anything. Like, I'm seeing my grave. What am I missing here? Do I left-click? No. No. Boy, I am super confused. Do I need to research the technology? Boy, I feel dumb. Do you have any suggestions here? No, I don't have any idea of what we're looking at. It says something about a carpenter's table. Do you have one of those? Oh, maybe I should follow the frickin' arrow. Maybe what's going on is I haven't built whatever I need to repair that shit with <laughs> I think yet. that's the way to the village. It sure is. Let's just go check it out for now since it's getting late. We uh, can the negative the two above where you're at, go there. Oh, okay. I'll swing by there once I'm back from wherever I'm going. Can I run? I cannot run. Yep. Kalen says the arrow Which takes you, you to the village. Okay. Let's just go to the village for a second. We can check in on the tavern and sell this thing. Ooh. That's actually really nice effects. The swing oh, of wheat. Oh, nice. I'm Ryu getting a sudden. Says aside from the graveyard and nuking the graveyard and calling the job done, I have no idea. Huh. Well, let's. Wow, this is one rundown. Ta dead horse. The tavern is called the Dead Horse. That's really funny. All right, let's uh, talk to the barkeep. Hey, barkeep. Welcome to the Dead Horse Tavern. I am Hordrick. How can I help you? I came from the graveyard. I woke up today. And That's things an have Alamegan been name if I've ever seen one. Crazy since then. Uh, sorry, how could I not have recognized you? Good. This is good. Ah, that's a creepy smile. Things are looking bright for our small village. When are you planning to open the church? I need to fix the graveyard first. Sure, sure, it has been a while since anyone took care of it. So let's get down to business, shall we? How can I help you? Um about this burial certificate. The bishop would like, told me that you would buy the burial certificates. Yes, he's right, as head of the village. According to the ancient contract, I have to trade it for money. Of course, only if I have any money. What do you mean? The village is going through hard times or short on money. But as soon as you open the church, pilgrims will bring lots of shiny coins to the village. All right, well, here's some meat. 
Meat is a delicacy in our village. I'd be glad to buy it. I just need to see the royal meat stamp. Uh, okay. Many years ago, there was an accident with an inappropriate meat. Ever since, all meat must be approved by royal authority. And while I don't need to any trouble with the town. Does your meat have a stamp? No, it does not. I don't even want to know where you can get unauthorized meat, but wow, it looks really good. Okay, then. But without a stamp, my hands are tied. Where can I get the stamp? Oh, you can send a form to the royal court through the mailbox near the church, but it'll cost you a bundle. There's another way. I'll tell you because we're neighbors. Come closer. There's this guy called... Snake. I think he has a fake royal stamp. But to be honest, I haven't seen him for a while. You can ask Ms. Charm. She comes here every whatever the fuck that is. I bet she can help you find Snake. Uh, thanks, buddy. So I guess that's that. We can't really do anything else here. Oh, Keeper, would you kindly take this letter to our local blacksmith, Kresvold? Sure, where can I find him? The southeast corner of this village. Okay. Ooh, there's a lady up there you can talk to. Yes, I saw the the wench. Miss Chain. You must, you be, must the new be the new graveyard keeper. <laughs> so I've been told, but how did you know? Oh, if you live as long as I have, you'll probably learn how to read people too. Where's my manners? I'm Miss Chain, Heredric's wife. Oh, good thing I didn't offer to buy you a cheeseburger then. Nice to meet you. I have a few questions about... Oh, oh, you better talk with my husband. He's in charge around here. I mean, we did. He's not only the tavern keeper, but also the elected head of the village. Besides, he really does like to talk. All I can do is sell you some recipes. I have to say, she's got the cleavage necklace thing going. I like that style of medieval dress since it shows off lots of boobs because as we all know pyro is a boob man there's a quote all right well i talked to your husband great oh i see those are days of the week there are six days of the week and the bishop is going to come tomorrow assuming it goes clockwise oh no next week yes but it was this symbol like it was the little starburst symbol. Does it go clockwise? That is an excellent question. And one I don't have it. Oh, unless the day's already passed and this is the new day. I don't know. A little confused. Let's go back to the graveyard. Man, I hope I can get a horse or something eventually. Ray I says am... it'd be really awkward to offer to buy a cheeseburger from the innkeeper for the innkeeper's wife. <laughs> Sounds like something Pyro would do. This is cool. It's actually keeping all my footprints there. Like, you know, usually games have a limit to how many they save and display, but this one has a ton. I'm curious when that's going to re- Come uh, here! Where you been? I was at the village. This place is so weird, but it feels so real. And everyone is okay with me just appearing out of nowhere. Sod, you're stealing my thoughts! Stealing... I remember there's a cellar in your cottage. Some provisions must be stored there. Uh... Okay. Wheat! Exactly! I remember baking, baking bread out of it. And pies. Sweet berry pies. Okay. Toast, onion, toast. Oh, that's good with beer. Sod, you know what? I need a beer! This is beginning to feel like a one-sided relationship. Bring me bear and I'll tell you a lot of important stuff. Like how you can get home. Uh, questions? I'm good. Oh, I guess I can't say that. About the small road. It was rhetorical. Do I look like a magic head with answers? Uh, yes. Sod, you smart ass. I'll be waiting for that bear at my place. No bear, no answers. God damn. Damn it. Okay, well, let's go see if I can repair the thing now that Kaelin kindly provided me some extra instructions. It seems that we don't... Oh, I was going to say it seems that we don't have to worry about energy, but I have energy I need to worry about. So shit, man. Okay, so what am I doing? Grave. Go to here. Nothing's appearing. She said the negative two. The negative... Okay. 
Oh, do I just click this thing? Oh, okay. I get it. I feel a little dumb, but I get it. So, okay, and then I have to repair the... Okay. Okay, fair enough. Tofa says, well, double fun Sunday, you too, Skelly Man. Okay, so now I'm out of repair materials. I think. Because I just burned my last couple. So let's see what happens if I go to a place and it yells at me that I can't repair it. Okay, zero out of two, five, right. Okay, but I can fix the stone bits because Kayla I says have stone press F to kits. work and B for boobs. I wish I could just hit B for boobs just in my everyday life. That would be fantastic. All right, boop. Okay, what did he want it at? Negative five? I think so. Oh, well, he's gone now. Doesn't matter. All right. I'll be back in a week. Yep. And I don't have enough materials anyway. So let's head into the thing and see if I can... Oh, hi. I actually didn't mean to go to you. Uh... Oh. Wow, this does have this harvest moon feel to it, doesn't it? Yes. Because, like, here's this thing in my way, and then I'm like, how, how do? And then just suddenly I get info. All right. I can repair the mortuary desk. Dude, this is cool. Uh, again, I got this game for free, but this is really cool. Corpse hatch. Ew. All right, so I guess what we need to do is get the get the beer before anything else is going on. So let us head back to the tavern. Look, see, my footprints are all still here. <laughs> like all of them, yeah. even where I freaked out. Okay, but not past. Well, no, they are still there past it. That's they look like they're slowly cool. fading, though. Very slowly. Very slowly, yes, but the fact that it still saved all of these footprints, because, I mean, it still saved them all the way. All the way to the village. Holy crap, man. Cosmic Phoenix says that That's looks really like awesome. Stardew. This looks a lot like Stardew Valley to me. Yeah, Stardew Valley, Harvest Moon. Harvest Valley. Any of that. <laughs> Stardew Moon. Southeastern corner, right? Do I have a map? <gasps> I do have a map. All right, so where am I? Looks like you're. You know what? I like the fact I don't get to see where I am. Like you don't have a compass, so that's cool. Okay, so the I need a marker. So where's the tavern? Here's the tavern. Okay, so it's. So I'm here. So I need to go. It's like the last road on my right, so on my character's left, so it's either that one or, nope, it is that Tofa one. Tofa says, okay. where are the boobs? I clicked the boob button. And Lord Ariadus is like, in your search history? Yes. Tofa says, nope, I cleared that. Okay. Hey, what are you staring at? Nothing, just looking around. I think I'm the keeper of the local graveyard. May I, I ask just, who you are? I just thought of something mean. Uh, Head to your bathroom and look in the mirror and you'll see a big one. Unfort unfortunately, I am the local blacksmith. My name is Kresvold. Uh, here's a letter. I have a letter for you from Hordorek. A letter, of course. One minute away and he can't be bothered to come himself. <laughs> I guess hold habits never die. Thank you. Sorry for my nagging. It seems it's my habit. Ugh, slimes again. Hordorek asked me to get rid of them. I don't have the time for those pesky little green bastards, but maybe you can help. Take this rusty sword and, en and an energy potion. The sword is broken, but you can repair it with a whetstone on the grinder behind me. You can keep the whetstone. Maybe you'll need to repair your shovel sometime. If you manage to kill them, bring me their remains and I'll spare you some materials. They should be right up the other side of my house, near the puddles. Uh, energy, crafting, you can refill, sleeping will also, got it, okay, thanks, bye. Alright, so, pick a resource to use, sword, one whetstone craft, work, work, work. Hooray, got my whetstone back and also have a rusty sword. Or, wait, that is a good thing, right? Do I need to sharpen it again? No. 
I can't sharpen it, but that's fine. That means I'm ready. Okay, so where did he say the pond behind? Ah! Slimes! Uh. Let's equip. What the fuck? You need to sharpen it with a whetstone. No, it's 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 on. So now I just have to figure out what the attack button is. Wait, what? I have to sharpen it with a whetstone? But I can't. Like, see? Didn't he give you the whetstone? He gave me the broken sword, and I changed it to a rusty sword. Huh. So I did sharpen it. So now I have to figure out what the button is to attack. Or I have to figure out how to equip the thing. There's a little icon here that implies it's equipped. Yeah, five damage, so it is equipped. Oh, what if I just click the stupid... Nope, that didn't do it. Uh, space? You really space! Low on I sure do. I have so little energy I can't even swing a sword anymore. Let us drink a potion. Drinky, drinky. Gulp and whoosh. Whoosh. It is Stardew Valley. Whoosh, whoosh. Gravekeeper Valley. Gravekeeper Valley. I defeated the slimes. Thank you for simple iron parts. Good job. Take this whetstone. Just sharpen your broken tools and they'll be as good as new. Okay, I can create green and red jelly. Thanks. Uh, all right. Let's sharpen my shovel, I guess. Cool. All right. Topa says, rust is good. Give your enemies tetanus. Yes. Okay, I think we're done here because I am exhausted. I've been up two days straight, just like I almost was in real life. And that wasn't pleasant for anybody. I almost thought about streaming while I was delusional and going crazy. But uh, I was good and just actually went to bed. All right. He did give me a rusty sword, not a broken sword. Oh. Yeah, whatever. Okay, let's see if we can find our way home. Maybe it's that small road that we saw Gary in. Ooh, that was a weird load. Let's see, that's by the order of the Great Inquisitor, this path is closed until Day of Guys. Okay, you got it. I, nope, all right. Let's, here we go. Is this home? Is this leading me home? I think this is home. What is this? The garden, property and forfeiture. For commercial use, contact the tavern owner. Uh, all right. Wow, this is a big area you can expand to eventually, you know? Yes. There's a lot of stuff Look here. Look at all that potential corpse. Yeah. Place for stones. Place for wood logs. Place for sleep. It's our trunk for... Oh, and there's a, there's a grinder right here. Cool. All right. This is pretty handy. Oh, he said there were provisions in your cellar. Yep. What's that sound? Uh. Damn. Damn gate. I'll come here every night if I have to, but I'll get through eventually. Uh. Okay. Looks like I'm going to remove the blockage and fortify the arch. But I need... Ten wood wedges and two wooden planks. Okay, well, let's do that in the morning, because I am very sleepy right now. Kaylin says, probably... don't forget to finish the grave quest. What grave quest? Probably the one to clean up the graveyard. Oh, yeah, totally. Yeah, we'll get it. I just need to make some repair materials first. But we'll see if, uh, now that I got my energy back... Oh, ah, there's a ghost here. This is not good at all. Who do you think you are? I'm the new gravekeeper. <laughs> Hooray, a kipper. Wow, I've been here for how long? I'm Yorick. I'm so lonely. Poor, poor me, it's too bad you're here. What? Wait, no, on the contrary, I'm very glad to see you. But we do have a rather unpleasant fellow buried here. We'd really like to have a new neighbor instead. That sounds like something you can help us with. Not exactly sure why I'm here. 
Uh, Gary, uh, Jerry only told me about burying bodies. You're Yorick and he's Gary. Jerry, whatever. That's funny. Ha, <laughs> ah, the half-dead skull, that jealous bastard. Ha <laughs> ha. He can only dream of what a peaceful rest we're having. Kamoko says, did you know him, Horatio? Ah, <laughs> uh, who am I kidding? It's terrible here. Especially that guy down in the lower right corner grave. He's so mean. Could you just get rid of him, dig him up, and throw him in the river? You got it! I can even give you this license that I stole when I was alive. What license? Here's such a dummy. To dig up a corpse, you need a license. The old grave keeper used to buy them through the mailbox near the church. Uh, okay. Let's go dig up a- wait. Hold on, one thing at a time here. Let me see what I can- oh wait, I can't even do anything there, right? I got a recipe called Simple and Tasty. I can build another trunk. Simple and Tasty, create baked mushrooms and baked apples. Can I, what can I do here? Oh, wood plank, okay. Fletch, what is a fletch? Got some nails. Got, whoa, lots of stuff. Wow, there are a lot of provisions down here. Lots of flour. We can make wheat. All right. You all right? You're a little quiet. Um, nothing's going Just... on. So I'm, I'm like, a long while back, you remember we were messing with the old bed frame and I dropped it on my foot? No, I don't remember that. No, oh no, it was the mattresses. Yes, I do remember that. Like, the thing is still working its way up, and I'm just, like, kind of willing it to grow so I can get that out. Uh, okay. That's random. All right, let's grab yes. this body. Let's exhume. To exhume a body, you need exam exhumation permission. Are you sure you want to exhume? Yes. Cool. All right. It's a 100% body. That's awesome. Ooh, let's get him to the morgue. Oh, yeah. Before we just toss him in the river, let's carve some body parts out of him. Good thinking, the Akamura. You're a natural at this. I'm the devil. You are. Oh, god damn it. Ugh, oh, these bodies are so heavy. God damn it. Fucking body. E. Oh, let's grab some flesh. Cool. Chunk, 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 chunk. Do you awesome. have my beer? I mean, I will say. How, how are you doing, Gary? Oh, nice call. Here's my beer. I'll, I'll get it. See you Just later. Relax, dude. All right, let's let's go. Nurse Nono Square is back. Oh, that's not Nurse Nono Square. I don't know. Do do we have a voice for your voice for whatever? A name for your voice? I call it Bago voice because that's who right. I use it for. I have to come uh, up with the Bago is a kobold obsessed with blowing things God, up. God, my arms are tired. In Final Fantasy fourteen. All right, we're gonna just kick it off the shore. I have to chuck it in. Oh, I have to chuck it in. Well, easy come, easy go. I'm a horrible person. <laughs> ah, where did you come from? What do you think you're doing there? The ghost asked me to... You weren't paying attention for a second, were you? Sorry. It's okay. So what? Now you're just going to do everything he asks? I know these streams are hard for you when you're not the one playing. It's not like he can do anything to you. <laughs> He's disembodied. Uh, right. Whereas I can bite you to death while you're sleeping. Okay. Of course. I never do anything like that. Because we're friends! But you get my point, right? Anyway, if you ask me, the best way to get rid of a body is to burn it. Uh, do you know where the river leads? The river. Somewhere down to the town, I think. Probably don't want to know where the body's going, but how do I burn a body? You know what? You're one of those guys who looks a lot smarter than they actually are. Thanks. That's what I'm talking about. <laughs> I don't understand. You need fire and some wood. <laughs> it's a bit tricky to make the whole thing burn to ash. 
Where can I burn it? <laughs> you need a nice, quiet place. Like the place I use for my meditation. Across the road from the mortuary entrance, near the cliff. Wow. Do I have a quest list somewhere? Because I am starting to get the chat was with moving, so I was reading. Sorry. I need to do here. Uh, Kaylin really wants this game. Links uh, in the video description. Tofa says Akamura is my dad. What? Yeah, I don't know. I saw that too. Let's. Uh, all right, we we've got to come up with a mission here because now I've got too much to do. Let's talk to Snake. God damn it! Ah. <sighs> Is my job never done? This is why I need a... Wait, where am I going? Oh, yeah. So I do that, and then I say build a gravestone. Grave Don't site. you want to pick some meat off of it? I... Oh, shit, I do. Uh, Tits. All right. Come on, body. Let's see. Problem is I'm broke. Aw. It's all right. That's the nice thing about digital games. Things. What? I have your back with all the monster things. Yes, you sure do. And Switch. the fans have my back when it comes to just trying to keep all this shit straight in the first place. All right. Got my flesh. Gonna take the body. Gonna bury this shit. Too old and too tired for this. This make me sick in real life. All right, so we'll just chuck that shit right there. I like how he's lifting that body fully over his head like it's not going to break and splatter all over him and they just the nastiest freaking. Yeah. I don't know if it's being picked up but there's a uh... oh and then I get a burial certificate. Oh. So hey. I guess I should do my job. Damn it. Okay so let's work on Snake right now. Let's see if we can get Snake. Oh you need to talk to that one lady. What? What one lady? What's her name? Who's there at the tavern on certain days? Because she's no, she knows where to find him. Sna we we went, we found Snake. We did. Yeah. Snake Snake visited our place on the other side. See, there he is. That's oh. Snake right now. Oh. He's trying to get to the gate, and he's upset that he can't get to the gate. So we need ten wood wedges, two wooden planks, and four iron parts which we already have so let's see if we can make the wooden bits so let's clear this out this is giving me like serious uh, harvest moon on the super nes flashbacks which reminds me i probably could say this um i've decided what we're gonna do for the birthday stream this year uh which i i still don't know what day exactly it's going to fall and I hope you will all uh, forgive me for indulging, but I have recently been feeling very nostalgic, and I am a little worried that I'm going to take this too far, so I hope I don't. But what I'm going to do is I figured I needed a nostalgia day, and my birthday is probably a good time for a nostalgia day. So I will be using, uh, or I will be playing... Um, Hmm. I'll be playing a few games from my past, like Super NES games, and then I'm when I get off the stream, I'm going to watch some old cartoons that I grew up with, and that will be my birthday to me. So that is what you guys can share with, share with me and such. Hopefully that sounds interesting to you, and that I didn't just bore you to death. Okay, so it looks like I can't even create a flitch yet. I would need to get this technology, which got it, and then I need wooden wedges, got it, okay. So I need, I can now make a saw sawhorse, which is what I'll need for the flitch. And I would need to make a chopping spot, which is what I need for firewood, okay. So do I do those here? I do, so we make a sawhorse. No, we don't. We're going to clear out all these shitty trees first. Go away, shitty tree. Kaylin said something randomized. I can't quite um, parse that. A uh, link to the past. Um, nah. Uh, actually, actually, like I've I've been grabbing the ROMs, which has been difficult due to Nintendo's new thing, but I did find a site that still has them. Um... 
So uh, one of them is going to be a baseball game. One of them I've played at least twice for the channel, but I'm going to play it again because fuck it. So, um, so I get six flitches off of one wood, one log. Let's see if this doesn't destroy my energy completely. Cool. There's my log. Pick up the. Oh, I have to. Got it. Uh. What? Oh, I prob. Wait, what? Sawhorse. Oh, do you need to keep chopping it down? No. Let me go to sleep and we'll figure this out in the morning. This is a really, really fun game. Okay, um. So, uh, one of the. Yeah, I guess I could say it. The one that I have a feeling. Um, that you guys oh, right. you says to the left will the probably summers. not give two shits about is King Griffey Jr.'s baseball. And I know that sounds weird to do for the stream, but I want to do it. Um, I just want to play one baseball game. They're only like 20 minutes long. They're shorter than most games. Good. It's much nicer without him at the graveyard. I'm still so sad, though. I'm so lonely. I was bad when I was alive. I should have been a better person. What do you mean? We're dead, but we still deserve some respect. Ah, oh, fine, I'll tell you. Each corpse is a soul's vessel. It bears the mark of his life. Sins are red and good deeds are white. Even the best decorations can't make graveyards a peaceful place when it is full of sins. Okay, got it. I'm not sure I understand what you're talking about. No, I got it. I got it. Don't worry, buddy. I'm, I'm on top of things. I'm <laughs> sure you don't. <laughs> you better take a good care of the graveyard. I'll be watching you. Uh, Kalo, there is, um, I can't do anything. I'm so sad. Boo. Tutorial graves. All human remains have their own unique spiritual attributes. Corpse gets its body. body parts can change. Corpse. Removing organs and embalming. The main way is to increase. Da, 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 da. Decorate graves. Each line that has both a skull and a thing counts as one E. Lines that have an E never count, but you can fill them with E to reach E lines. Got it. That actually is very clever and easy to understand, even though I made weird noises. Um, there is a Final Fantasy VI randomizer. I am currently arguing with myself whether to do it for the show. Um, oh! Holy shit, that's really handy, but not what I need right now. I think that is what you need right now. Uh, well, hold on. I need a flitch, and I need to do that on a sawhorse. Did I? Is that a sawhorse or is that a chopping spot? I think that's a sawhorse. Oh, I have to put the log in the thing. So Ryu was right. See, when when the yep. log's not in the thing, it doesn't count. Okay. Can you pass right. me the toenail clippers? I gotcha. Let's make six flitches after we hand the Akamura her toenail clippers. All right. Um, but yes, uh, I've thought, I'm arguing with myself whether to do the Final Fantasy VI randomizer because some of the features sound really amazing. One of them will drive uh, Lord Eridos completely insane because it randomizes the command inputs for Blitzes. Um, but I am thinking about that. The only thing is, I don't really want to do it for the show because I still want to do my Terrorless run, but that said, the Terrorless run probably isn't going to be all that exciting to watch for most people. Um, whereas, okay, I need five of those, so I need another log. Um, whereas a randomizer, I think, would be pretty freaking cool because there probably aren't as many of those on YouTube. So I am currently arguing with, with, with myself what I want to do. Um, I think if I do a randomizer challenge instead, it'll get more views, uh, and it'll certainly be unique, whereas the Terrorless run is something I've been wanting to do for a long time, and may or may not be interesting, So I, uh, but it's something I've wanted to do for a long time. So I am currently arguing with myself what I want to do for Final Fantasy VI. Also, Cam bought me a game, and I want to get started on that one. So the Akamura and I discussed whether we're doing that next or whether I'm, uh, whether I'm 
going back to Dog Island or something else, so I don't know what I'm doing for the next little bit. We got plenty of games, though. That's for damn sure. So Polar Dread is asking if you feel like doing a Monster Hunter World stream tomorrow. Uh, maybe. Stay in touch with me about it. On your channel or my channel? I mean, I guess it doesn't matter either way since we host each other on Twitch, but I don't know. Maybe. <laughs> that's that's as far as I'll go with it. Maybe. Um, Monster Hunter does sound fun, though. <laughs> now that I've reinstalled it. Okay. Let's, what the fuck? No, chop the stupid tree. Uh, uh yes, random blitzes. It ran well, not every time, obviously. Just I, I think what it does is the first time you go and do it, uh, it's just a different command. But they do randomize commands as well. There are no random characters, but... There are some really hard ones, like random enemy things, which means anytime you encounter an enemy anywhere, it can be literally any enemy. So it is entirely feasible that you open a dragon in the light world and run into a dragon from the dark world, which would be bad for everybody involved. So I'm, Or you run I'm into tempted. freaking doom gaze. Yes. Also, for what however he did it, he put in the patch notes that he also randomizes um the final dungeon, but I don't know in what context. So, it sounds really intriguing. Uh, I'm I'm considering at least playing it for myself. I just don't know if I'll put it on the channel. Okay, we need the wood wedges. And that might wear me out, but nope. Barely. Kamoko says, what about the Veld? Um, one of the really nice things that he added was a quality of life thing where it alphabetizes Gao's rages, which is freaking fantastic and should have been the thing in the first place. Um, the Veld itself, I don't know, but the, the Veld itself was always coded so that you could encounter anything anyway that you've already encountered, except some bosses. So I don't know if he's changed that. It didn't, there was no specific information in the, um, in the patch notes about it, for better or worse. Ah, shit. Two wooden planks. Uh, alright. To get wooden planks, I need... Woodworking! Oh, and I get a wood repair kit! Oh, that's... That's helpful. Alright. Now I can make a carpenter's bench, too. But there's already a carpenter's bench out here, right? That's what this is, right? Oh, shit. Your voice. The Inquisitor! I've just seen the Inquisitor, right nearby, going up the path to Witch Hill. Oh, Sod, he'll kill me, or even worse. Calm down, I'll go distract him. Maybe I'll find something on that hill that'll help me get home. What? It won't, but okay. All right, so what hill? Behind my house, he said? Witch Hill. You know where Witch Hill is, it's down the street. Is it? A little bit, yep. Oh, it's the thing that the guys were guarding. Okay. Look at that, the footprints are still... My god, man, that's awesome. It's just a cute little graphical touch. God damn it, I don't want to frickin'... You know... Not yes, now. I agree, not now. Get out of here. Okay. Boy, I wish I had a horse or something. Hi. Everything is ready, Monsieur. God, what are there any problems? No, Mon... Monsieur? Is that it? Anyway, except there's a strange fella snooping around. Oh, there he is. Halt! Guys, calm down. I live here at the graveyard. He calls us guys. Well, he's a cultist for certain, Monsieur. Uh, I'm, I'm the graveyard keeper. I work as the keeper of the local graveyard. You can ask any of the villagers about me. Then you're definitely a new one. I feel that you're telling the truth. Would you join me at the witch burning ceremony? Uh, sure. It would be my honor. So how did you find yourself in such an interesting position? I... Actually, I'm from another world. I, I'm not entirely sure how I got here. I need to get back home to my love. I don't think that's an appropriate time for jokes. And I don't appreciate your general demeanor. You're a dick. Yeah, I am. The Great Inquisitor. 
I protect the one true faith in humankind itself. Do you? We're having a tough time in the town. The ship of the dead is already overloaded, and there's a new one stuck in the shipyard. Your graveyard is opening again into suspiciously auspicious time. Uh. The dark cult is rising. I can feel it. Righteous anger rises within my soul. We haven't revealed a witch for a long time. And now we're lighting up the second one this year. And it's only the beginning. You sound a little too happy about this. Burn the witch! Burn! Light the fire! Yes, Monsieur. Long live the great Inquisitor, Inquisitor, hurrah. Hurrah, hurrah, hurrah. Wrong with you people. So, you work with a lot of dead bodies, huh? Uh, yeah, I think it's part of my job. And you live right beside this hill near the graveyard, that's right? Yes. Interesting, interesting. You know, I need someone to be my friend here at the village. A friend of mine is a friend of the Holy Inquisition. Villagers, they're different from us town citizens. You can't trust them. But you're new here. You might notice something unusual. Uh... Okay. Sure, it'll be a pleasure to be your friend. A wise choice. Friendship is based on trust and goodwill. To earn my trust and be a friend of the Inquisition, you first have to show your goodwill. So I have a couple of minor tasks for you. Like... Everything in due time. Today is a day of wrath, not a day of sweating the minor details. We can talk next... Or rather... I like to come here. There's no other place where I can feel my holy wrath so deeply. It's the only way I can sustain an erection these days. We haven't invented Viagra yet. Amazing that he wants to come on the days that have the male symbol there. I don't think we can find any body parts on it. Oh, oh, oh. All right, well, bye, sir. You fucking weird. All right. So what am I doing now? I fixed the... Oh, I needed... Oh, the whole reason I came out here was because I got distracted, right? R right? You were going to distract the uh, Inquisitor for the skull for Jerry? Right. So, because I was trying to work on fixing the gate in my basement. So, god damn fucking Ray body. Ray says, bonus, we found a place to burn bodies. That's true. That is true. Maybe if I'm too full up on corpses, I can... All right, so what can I... Can I just build the thing here? Or... Nope, I can only... All right, that's fine. So I need to build... A carpenter's workbench. So let us build a carpenter's workbench. Cool, I've got all the stuff I need for it. Boop, done. Okay. And hammer, hammer. Um, you're not seeing it, but like there I only held the F key. The game is smart enough to steer the dude to the crafty spot on his own, which is nice. How many wooden planks did I need? Does anyone remember? Kaylin says that's not the place you burn bodies at. Oh, it's not. Hey, look, an outhouse. There is a toilet. Can I use it? I am forever denied. I must continue on with this poop in my purple pants. That is not a good life that I lead, but it is mine. All right. I need two wooden planks. That's it. Okay. Well, let's go get two wooden planks because oh we need to get to snake because snake has the fake um deedly boop remember yes we need him to sell meat well right right and that's how we can okay so that'll be that'll be our stri our goal here so we need to get down there anyway oh and it's almost midnight we might actually even run into him go 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 don't run off, Snake. Right, you says yep, that's there a is. shame that that's not the place you burn bodies, because if you could use your connection to the Inquisitor, because it would be clever to use your connection to the Inquisitor to burn bodies. Well, I am his friend now. 
Maybe I can be like, hey, this body was unusual. So maybe I can. Look, I throw it in the river and it floats. Hold still. Who are you? I'm the graveyard keeper and prior of this church, apparently. Mind your business. Uh -oh. I have a dagger and I'll gladly use it. Uh, Try to threaten him. You may have a dagger, but I have a sword. Okay. But you should know I fight like a beast to the death. To the death. Uh, I'm ready to die. Are you? Uh, on the other hand, he looks dangerous, but on the other hand, I'm definitely not ready to become a murderer. Yet. I won't fight you. But stay away from my property. Ugh, I have no use for rotten flesh and old books. Oh, okay. What is the yellow? We don't know what the yellow is. Let's see if I can figure out what the yellow is. Humble marker. Oh my gosh. I can get cremation. Wow, there's a lot of technologies in this game. Book writing, smithing, building. Look at all this stuff. Tricks of the trade. Cookery. Caitlin has added the quote, I must continue on with this poop in my purple pants. I mean... Nice alliteration. Thank you. All right. I, I don't know what the yellow thing is. Which probably means I'm not supposed to know what the yellow thing is. Right? Probably? Not yet. Yeah, not yet. But soon. Okay. Well... So Snake's probably just going to hang out there all day. Oh, I wonder where this goes. I wonder if it's a shortcut. Hey, things. Donk. Yay, nails and fletch. What is fletch? I mean, in context, I sort of understand, but I wonder what it actually is. Ooh, I wonder if that's a shortcut. The door is closed. Okay, so what are our tasks otherwise? Do we have tasks? We still need to clean up the graveyard. Graveyard keeper, that's you. You need to get back home. Oh, and this is where all this, the um, quests are. Get a beer for the tavern. Inquisitor, you definitely don't want to be his enemy. Meet me on any mail. Uh, Snake, he seems dangerous, and you get why everyone calls him Snake. Bishop, his motto, pray, preach, and look like you won the lottery. Reach plus five E at the graveyard. Donkey, a talking donkey, delivers bodies. York is a spirit. Creswold is a well-built man with a glorious mustache. Miss Chain is the beloved wife of the tavern keeper. And Hordrick, I need to find a stamp and I need to bring the letter to Creswold and return. Oh, hey, there's something we can do then. All right, let's uh, head up to the tavern and see if we can finish off that quest. Maybe we'll get something for it. There you go, buddy. It's good to, that you know how to use a sword. Kresvold told me you, how you helped him. Here, have a beer. It's on the house. Oh, sweet. All right. Thanks, buddy. Uh, Nah, fuck the garden. I don't care right now. Holy crap. I'm going to play the shit out of this game. Like... Everybody's making snake jokes. Nerds. So going to play the shit out of this game. What's probably going to wind up happening is since you're on more of a third shift hour now, because uh, I've been awake, I've been a good little boy, I've been awake since uh, about 7 or 8 this morning, so I have first shift hours, whereas the Akamura has the hours that I used to have, uh, being all, all up until I need to do is 2 go in to the morning, a reasonable hour. And, and then I was sleeping until 3 o'clock in the afternoon. I wasn't up until two in the morning. I was up until ten because my insomnia kicked in. That's oh, there not my you go. fault. That's no, biology. Right. That's why I said two, because you tried to go to sleep. Now you says I think there's still a corpse over there. Yep. Ew. <laughs> this is fun. <laughs> All right. Corpses. What do I need for this? Corpse is Wendy's quality right now. I need a I need a piece of stone. Okay, let's see how to get that. God, this game is so cool. Oh, I love it. Okay, piece of stone is that. I need 15 red. How did I get red? I got red just doing shit. Red points represent your handcrafting skills and your ability to work with material. Okay. So I guess I just need to make more shit. Um, all right, let's deal with this body and then start making more shit. Oh, we need to oh, get yeah. Jerry the beer. Oh, yeah, here's your stupid beer. Where's my beer? Here's your beer. Jesus. Oh, what a disappointment. I think I need something stronger. Uh. All right. You seem like a decent guy. So here's some advice. 
Stop running around bragging that you're from another world. I don't remember too clearly, but it was for doing something similar that I lost my body. So if you want to keep yours, just stop. Oh, maybe he's our predecessor? Maybe he's right. Maybe I should be more careful. So what was your question? Uh, I ha have some questions. How can I get back home? Easy. You could just use the portal on Witch Hill. The portal? So I just need to go through it or what? Do I need to turn it on first? I obviously don't have a brain inside here, so I'm not sure where this knowledge is coming from. I've told you everything I can remember. Maybe some books from the library could help you. Wow, the church has a library in its cellar! Or maybe the young astrologer knows. He's a smart boy. How can I get to the library? Obviously through the church. And I think your wine cellar might be connected to the church cellar. Oh, even the morgue is connected. There's a network of tunnels down here. Net, net. I used to like fishing. I remember fishing. Once I caught a fish this... Sod, I've got no hands to show you how big it was, but believe me, it was huge. I hate fish tails. And once... Y you know what? I need to go. Sure, sure, it's nice to have legs. Don't forget to bring me some wine. God damn it. Alright, so... Oh, we can ask about the astrologer. Oh, he's so smart. And very tearful. Though I don't know him personally. I think. But his wine was the best. And he was a big friend of the lighthouse keeper. They used to hang out at the lighthouse every moon. <laughs> every moon day. Where is the lighthouse? Somewhere near. Let's see. Sorry, I don't remember. All these questions are so frustrating. You're not a very good friend, you know. Uh... Uh, okay. Kalo, See you later. Kalo brings up that maybe that symbol is money. Or he, that is, Kalo knows it's money, and it, for whatever reason, just did not occur to me. So, God, freaking. <laughs> These stupid bodies. I guess I've already dug a hole, so. We'll just, uh. Get down in the hole, you hole filled yeah, corpse. Just get your ass in there, please. All right, burial certificate. So I'm going to need five of those, or at least five gold, in order to pay off Snake. So how many of those do I have now? I have three. Okay, so now I need to focus on upgrading my skills so I can get stone and stone repair kits so I can work on continuing to fix the grave site. Rayu says, wait, there's a moon day every week? There's a bad yep. joke there, but I'm not saying it. Today is moon day. What was on Moon Day? Uh, I actually don't remember. The astrologer and the what's his the lighthouse keeper get together and exchange wine. Oh. And play grab ass, I guess. I mean, I guess I should look for them. Cosmic I? Phoenix says the moon is Friday. I mean, there's only six days of the week here, so. No, it's no. But I'll, I, I guess I'll take you up on that. Let's let's go down this road Friday, and explore. Friday, Friday, gotta get down on Friday. Everybody's looking forward to the weekend, weekend. Friday, Friday, getting down on Friday. Everybody's looking forward to the weekend. And we just lost every subscriber. Are you proud of yourself, the Akamura? Yeah. Are you proud of what you have done on yeah. this day? All right, so I need to keep building shit. Okay. Ryu is so tempted to explain. Um. Wait, there's a mo moon day? Oh. Moon is Friday, it skips Saturday. Only Sean can make Friday sound decent. Like, I was trying to match Rebecca Black, so... I guess I did a bad job by technicality. Mushrooms. Mushrooms. Ah, ah! Kaylin would like a clip of just that. What, you're singing? This is why you need to sing more on the channel. Uh, what am I doing? I'm sleeping. Yes, you you should. That's what we can do for the AP since all the mics will be downtown or the rest of the audio is out. You should just sing Friday and then everyone can isolate the audio. What with their recording materials and such. 
Pastel Energy Crystal. prefers Saturday, which is also a Rebecca Black song. I don't know if you guys have is seen it? that. Is it? Yes, she wrote a follow-up Saturday, and it's much better and has a lot of references to the first one. Oh, yeah. I think I remember hearing that. And I'm no like, one gave a shit because at that point she was actually half decent and had weathered all the bullying. So yeah, like Even at the time, like she did a really stellar freaking job of holding her own against a shitload of trolls. Oh, yeah. Like, she's a freaking hero now. Like, even if she was... You know, and I never even thought the original song was that bad. Like, it's not good, but fucking Rolexes exist, yes. so... Uh, you know. yeah. When I first heard it, it made me giggle, and I didn't understand why people hated it so much. Yes. Although, I will admit, I, I left a comment on that video and said something nasty. Because I was just sort of jumping Everybody on the bandwagon. Everybody left a comment yeah. on that video that was nasty. Yeah, but that doesn't mean I'm proud of it or happy about it. Luckily, it wasn't too nasty. I literally just said something about... And it wasn't even that funny and doesn't make any sense, which I know now in context. But I said something about her voice is worse than Fran Drescher's. Like, and that was the extent of my humor, which was dumb and stupid, and I felt bad. And I was going to delete that comment, but I can't find it because it's too old and too buried. So... Um... If anybody feels like digging back through the comments on Rebecca Black's Friday, find that comment so we can delete it. Well, like, there's a way you can find every comment you've ever left on YouTube. And the problem is I've left a ton of comments since then. Because I left that comment before I was a YouTuber myself. So, you know, it's a long list to get through since I have done a no, whole bunch of... Apparently Saturday is a guilty pleasure of Jennergy's. I think people Stunk. way overreacted to her Friday and jumped on the bandwagon. Yes. Yep. She was just a victim that people needed to destroy. Yep. Like, the real asshole is the guy who runs that record company, because he latched onto that and made that one Thanksgiving song. And I don't like, know what you're talking about. Like, he runs a company where you spend $3,000 and he'll write a song for you and make a music video. Oh, okay. Was that what she took advantage of in the first place? Yes. So, like, an 11-year-old girl, I think, later that year, also paid, like, the fee for a music video, and he wrote her a song about Thanksgiving, and essentially, like, after Rebecca, after the Rebecca Black thing, he's a, he was essentially offering her up to the slaughter. Oh, that's cause unfortunate. Because it was also terrible. That's it was really It was weirdly adorable because she was like singing into a turkey leg. Rebecca Black? No, the 11 year old. Oh, okay. Yeah, if you're 11 years old, that's like right at the age where you can pull that off and not have people destroy you. Hopefully. Anyway. What do I need to do the thing? Okay. That was a great conversation, but now my brain is completely shut down and I don't remember what I was doing. It's okay, just look Help. back through your quest list and we'll pick something. I need like I need four nails, but why did I need four nails? To build the stone cutter. Cuz this is my rock stockpile, right? I assume. Yes. Uh so I need four nails. How do I get nails? I cannot Ka make them Kaylin yet. says you underestimate how mean people can be on the internet to an 11-year-old. Yeah, that's true. That is true. People are assholes. That's why I'm trying to make my channel not that, you know? Gentle Butcher, you know how to work with meat. You have less chance of making a surgical error when extracting hard spares and soft spares, which is bones and blood and fat and skin and skulls. Ryu asks, did the corpse we tossed in the river end up at the town slash village slash whatever? That is an excellent question. And I do not know the answer. Man, this this game is so nice. Like, there's, there's a weird piece to it. Because it's weird, obviously, but, you know, like this. I'm just exploring. I just went off in a random direction. Let's follow this road and see where it goes. Hmm. Clear the path. Okay. That's something I can't handle right now. Let's keep on going. Hey, look, there's a thing. Broken apiary. We can hot get burbs. And there's a bunch of broken shit up here that we can collect. 
for experience points or whatevs. Like, our house is massive, you know? Nice, metal scrap. Yeah. Let's see if that updated the... Nope, did not update the... And this map is freaking huge if all of this leads somewhere. Like, see, there's a path here. There's something south of the kitchen garden. Wow, there is so much here. All right, we need to come up with a task to do. So, Kalo mentioned it probably is five bucks to bribe Snake. Let's bribe Snake and then call an end of the stream. And then move on to the hidden after party. Yes. Uh, what is this? Oh, campfire. Neat. And we can burn a body there, probably. Convenient that it's located right next to my house. Okay. I was gonna say, uh... Oh, that's what I was doing Jerry for. said that the place to... I wanted a that. I wanted a this. I wanted to fix the corpse hatch. Okay. Uh, Jerry said that the place to burn bodies is south of the mortuary? Because uh, it's where he meditates. Right. Let's uh, head south real quick. Oh, there's a thing. Crematorium. Okay. Maybe that's what he means. Like, we can eventually put a crematorium here. Yep. For now, we're just going to dump them in the river when they're dicks. <laughs> exactly. Um, yeah, this is a whole... Man, well, I actually... Says, since we got the stone tech, can we harvest rocks? Uh, I would assume so. I was going to say, you had an F next to a huge yeah. stone, so maybe that's what you need to harvest to make the thingy. Well, that'll thingy get me... Oh, that's true. Maybe I actually get smaller chunks of stone by harvesting big-ass chunks of stone. Let's find out. I only need two. Think. A piece of stone. But I don't know if that's the thing I needed. Go check the thing? Yes. Let's go find it. Because if I can get the corpse hatch fixed, that'll be good. Oh, yes. yeah, you're right. Okay. So we just need to go back north and find another rock bit. You're probably going to play the crap out of this game, aren't you? Oh, yeah. Like, it's when you're not so on Stardew Steam, Valley. It, it's the Akamura simulator. <laughs> Let's be honest. Yeah, especially since eventually you can chop up bodies and use them in meat pies. Okay, you didn't Mrs. Know that was Lovett. A, you didn't know that was a thing, did you? Jesus fucking shit, what is this, Sweeney Todd? Uh, sure. Okay, now I've got some stone. Corpse hatch! 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 Makes me think of frickin' when we played Stardew Valley with Tari and we all just stood in a field screaming parsnips. Oh, God, I want to play some more multiplayer Stardew Valley. That sounds a lot of fun. We made an offering to the parsnip gods and we're blessed. Yay, with body hatch! Gold parsnips. So when does the donkey deliver bodies, did it say? Whenever, I guess. Oh, there he is. Uh, he delivers bodies from a left-wing stable. Oh, ha ha, because he's a donkey and that's Democrats. Okay, great. All right, anyway. All right, so he hasn't done one yet. He hasn't made a body yet. I guess we may as well sleep, see if we can kill some time and if he'll drop one off. Because he didn't say he does it every day, does he? Like, I don't think he don't said know. when he does it, period. I think he just randomly does it. Okay, as we continue, we're running out of things to harvest unless they respawn somehow. Possibly. Um, that's how it works in most modern... Ooh, I think we need to repair the graveyard so that we can get the uh, town yes. commerce going. Because you, you need to make the graveyard look good right. for the bishop to do the dealy and then right. get pilgrims. Okay, how do I... What do I need to make wooden repair kits? I don't know. Let's go see. Wow, I could seriously play this Archmage game Archmage Kalen says, so then if the bridge to the right Wait. gets fixed, does that mean you'll have an elephant delivering bodies from there? <laughs> uh, that's a good one, Kalen. <laughs> all right. Uh, all right, let's see if Bill Yard... Um, I'm sorry, what were we going to do? My brain just uh, completely shut kits. down. 
repair kits. I need a carpenter's workbench. I need two pieces of iron Don't you have a workbench? Parts. Do I? Could have swore. Is that what this is? Is that not what that is? It is. Okay. I need planks and nails. God damn it. I'm going to have to find another way to get nails. Like, that's what's killing me. Now I've only got... I only have one repair kit. That's all I could afford. Ugh. Kaylin says, my joke made Pyro's brain shut down. Nice. Yes. It was very good. Um, so I'm going to have to find a way to get nails pretty soon, because otherwise we won't be able to get repair kits going, you know? Um, I mean, I guess we can work on the... I was going to say, figure out a way to make the place look like not shit. What the fuck? Without using repair kits? Did I not make repair kits? I think you made the stuffer one, but not the thing. Or you only made, like, one. I never made it. I just set the order and then never worked on the carpenter bench. Ugh. Oh, boy. Don't die on us, Pastel. I know middle school sucks, but you'll make it. I promise. Alright, let us deal with... No, I just never... Oh, but I get four from this. Okay. Oh, sweet. Alright, that's not so bad. But I still need nails. Like, I, I will need to get some nails. I'll have to find a way to get some. Um, it, It's implying I can eventually smith. I mean, not even implying I can eventually smith. So, maybe I can make nails that way. Alright, so let's repair the worst one first. I guess it doesn't really matter. Um, let's repair the wooden cross. Cool. Okay, and then we'll re repair the wooden grave fence. Alright, and then we'll repair this one. And then that's all my money, but we can still possibly make, um... Ooh. Get peat. Craft a compost heap, red flower. Okay. And then we can also look to see if we can make some headstones. Make a headstone. I need simple gravestone, carpenter's workbench. So what? Okay. So let's go back to the workbench again. Ryu asks, is there a thing in the tech tree that'll let you na make nails? I looked and there isn't yet. There might be something in the smithing category. Because as you can see, my smithing category is totally blank. Um, unless I'm not seeing it here. There's something down there called precious metals. Yeah, but you don't make... Yeah, there's nothing. You don't make nails from precious metals. Yeah, but there's mining. Like Right, but we can at least see what all of those do. I mean, we can get the mining technology. We can grab iron ore. Let's go ahead and grab that. Um, so now we can mine, but like that doesn't help us build or get nails, you know? Yes. Ooh, wine making. Yeah. This is cool, man. There's a lot of different things you can Kalen do. Kalen says game. unlock mining and then you can unlock smithing. Uh, wait, really? It's still down. I'll probably have to talk to somebody somewhere to do that. Let's see how much, um, let's see what it costs to do a gravestone. Wooden marker. Oh, man, I still need anv anvils. Crafted at I cooking table, wooden anvil. Anvil 2. Okay. I didn't think a wooden anvil would be a thing, but alright. So at least that gives me a hint. So let's see if we can find what a wooden anvil is. Um, let's see. Stone timber stockpile. Stone cutter assembly stand. Nope, nothing. We'll probably have to find a way to get it eventually. I mean, there's plenty of quests we still haven't done yet, you know? I think Kalo's right. We need to just keep saving money until we can get to Snake, and then we can sell the meat. And then that might help us out a little bit. 
Um, I guess for now, let's explore. Maybe we can find some shit to break up and then... Because remember, I got all my nails from destroying the debris that was under the house. So yes. I wonder if there's debris somewhere else that I can start hacking up. Mushrooms. Which I can't Eat pick for some reason. It's weird. Okay. Can I break up this stuff? Nope. Hmm. What a puzzle. But yet, yeah, since I'm not on a time limit, or even a fake time limit, like in um, Punch Club, I don't really feel pressured to do anything, you know? Oh, yes. maybe the blacksmith can give me some information. Well, there's an anvil. I wonder if he'll let me use his tools. Ask him where to find metal ore. Oh, sure. Let's unlock that. You know what? I like to work with metal myself. Where can I find some ore? You can find metal ore in the swamp soil. There's a huge swamp to the west across the river. God so we damn need to it. repair the... Yep. I used to collect ore there before the bridge collapsed. Oh, there we go. But now we got the technology. We can make a Fernacci. Right. And maybe we can make... Can we trade? Metal scrap. Uh, Yeah, he sells nails. They're just pricey. Need they are to super pricey. Those burial certificates. Yep. I wonder how much I'll get out of it. Uh, ah, tits. And then we can take our Fernacci and probably do smithing from there. Let's see if that unlocked it over here. Yeah, smithing. Everything unlocked. Okay. So we just need to spend ten um red points. Okay. And that's just wandering around, hacking you know, shit down, right? The fat what? It's just uh, wandering around and. Or buildings. Uh, hey, baby. What? Uh, wait, you're the girl. You want to be loved by me. I'm not good at scatting. Sorry, guys. Are you? Really? Yes. Go talk to her. Really? Go talk to her. No, I mean, really that you weren't good at that? You probably just gave at least one or two of the lurkers an erection. And one of them's a girl. Anyway, hi, Miss Charm. What do you want? Oh, God, don't use that voice, please. I mean, yes, use it, but holy shit. I'm a graveyard keeper, and I want to ask you some questions. She was supposed to help us with Snake. Oh. I see. You know how many times a day I hear that same mumbling? I have no time for you, little man. Come back when you have more faith in yourself. Uh... New task. Demonstrate that you are worth talking to. But... Ciao! Aww. Hey, old friend. Can I have a moment? Uh... Hi. I guess I have no choice. What did Miss Charm tell you? Literally to go away. <laughs> She's always so classy. She would never talk to just anyone. I'm not just anyone. I'm the local graveyard keeper. That makes me important and also stinky. Soon to be the prior of the local church. Pfft, primitive. I'm a well-known poet. In certain small circles, my name is Wagner. Or Wagner. I don't know. Wagner. Wagner. One day I'll read my poem to her and then we'll... <laughs> but first I need to write it and I am catastrophically out of paper and ink. Maybe you can get me some. Uh, sure. Journalist. I'm gonna delete that quote. I don't want that out of context. Um, <laughs> you notice the little things about people. Put these things together and you have a story. Sometimes... What is it, delete quote 19? Uh, yes. Del quote. Um, put these things together and you have a story. Sometimes you can get stories from dialogues. Oh, that's how I can do book writing. Where do I find paper and ink? You may have some of it in your church, or you can make it. I'm just not used to manual labor, but a skill for a man such as you can surely do it easily. Also, you could get some from the old astrologer. He goes to the lighthouse every moon day. He was my supplier before we had this ridiculous fight. Uh, okay, where's the lighthouse? And it's on a cliff to the east of the village, and it hasn't been in active use for a while. Bless the dead horse for staying open. One day I'll write a poem about this place, maybe even a couple lines about you. Kaylin says, worth it even if it was deleted. Um, what about the old astrologer? He's old and mad, whereas I've been studying for three, almost three, years at town university. Can you believe he turned out to be an idiot? 
He told me the Earth was round. Oh, <laughs> nonsense. Uh, it is round. Oh, God, you should definitely meet him. The mad astrologer and the gravekeeper, two wise men. Uh, I could make for a pretty funny poem. This astrologer must be the smartest man around. Maybe he'll help be able to help me get back home. Where can I find paper and ink? You may have some of it in your church, or you can make it. Yeah, 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 got it. Okay, thanks. God damn it, didn't mean to... Shut, shut up, shut up, you bastard. All right. So, I guess while I'm here, I'll sell these things. Um, let's, uh, wait, trade? Okay. All right, so I get one silver 50 for each. And he sells me food, including onion rings, which sound definitely tasty. That'll be it for now. Tinergy says next we bury the flat earther poet. Oh, I would love to. All right. If the blacksmith is still open, I'll see if I can buy some nails from him. So I want two nails to... There he is. He's working. Yep. Okay. Yeah, nails are cheap. I can get one for 25 whatever. So we need... Let me think. We need two to get... Um... What do we need? We need two for my stone thing. What else was I getting nails for? Repair kits. So let's just get as many as we can get. Oh, yes, let's. I can't even buy that many. Because I need to make gravestones anyway. So we'll get yes, 430. Yes, buy like a crap load of nails. That's good enough for now because we'll get our money back once we start... Um, once we start being able to actually bury bodies. The only thing is that doesn't fi that doesn't really help us with our problem with what to pay Snake off with. Unless I do have to talk to the lady. KJ and... Friend says the earth is flat. A circle is just a bunch of straight lines. <laughs> Ow, my head. Uh, <laughs> Kalo says, hashtag, there's the curve, idiots. Isn't the earth shaped like a little fatter around the equator so it's not like a perfect sphere it's kind of a squished sphere or something like that but it's such I'd say it more squished, resembles you like you know when you get the uh, rubber erasers that like what's the word I'm looking for the uh, needed rubber erasers you know the one I have yes it's sort of like it's sort of like that when it gets lost in the couch I see you pull it out and it's like you got this circle with all the weird little indents and bumps and like the weird pointy bits and some weird deep crevasses. That's that's the earth. I almost said something really naughty just because of something you just said because it's how we talk to each other by reflex. But I caught it because I remembered I have a microphone in front of my face. That is recording everything I'm saying right now. All right, let's build some wooden whatevers. I need planks. Uh, let's do three planks. And then I'll need some more wood so I can get more filiches or whatever they're called. Okay, so now I need I mean, six filiches. It kind of looks like a sphere because from a distance you can kind of see the atmosphere, but... So... Cutty, cutty, cutty. Lord Arieto says, it. you want to put your meat in Sean's crevasses? Um, yeah, that's basically where I was going with that. Anyway, let's, uh, let's finish making some repair kits. Uh, something, something, Mariana's Trench. Oh, that's probably what I did the one time I closed out rather than actually clicking the deedly boop. Can I? Oh, god damn it. Fucking... People informed on that little bit of trivia are busting up laughing now. Ugh. Good to know that, like, when you run out of energy, you don't, you don't just pass the fuck out. The game is just like, not enough energy to do the thing. I'm like, oh, okay. That's more realistic on, like, friggin' Harvest Moon. Ugh. Okay. Go uh, this away, and then we go uh, this away, and then we go uh, this away, and we go... Do this work, shit. work, work. All day long. Oh. Work, work, work till you die, die, die. Now we need two flitches. Yup, Kamoko got it. Let's see. How many unmarked graves do we have? At least three, right? 
So let's get three wooden markers, which means six fletches, which is perfect because that's the pack they come in. God, there's something really calming about this. Like, at the end of the day, this is no different than any other game that you... Ryu craft. says you can unlock better looking grape markers. Yes. Although right now I'm just going cheap because I just want to want to get somewhere with our graveyard. Pick up the... Why are you not picking that up? Your inventory's full. God, friggin Your inventory is full. <gasps> Let's uh, shove the flower, shove the flesh in there, shove the f that flower as well. Uh, I, I guess that's it for now. The wooden markers. I take was up gonna one say you each. always overload my inventory. Ha 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 See, this is the exact thing I was talking about earlier. Oh, hey, look, the mushrooms came back. Maybe they do all respawn then. Yay! Uh, Come on, man. Deliver me a body. I need the cash. Okay, so there's... Yeah, there's three that are unmarked. So, grave. And we add a gravestone. And grave. And we add a... Oh, I don't have fences made. Well, tits. Alright. Oh, tits on a cracker. That's better than nothing. And we can repair the ones that are bad, too. So, continue with your noises. So cute. All right. No! Let's see, that's... No! Gone. Not that, let's repair that shit. Um, hooray! Osmic Phoenix asks, is it better to dump people who have sinned in the river and bury non-sinners? That's a good point, because if the presence of a sinner is what's messing us up, then sinners should be tossed. Or burned. Or burned. You're tired. Oh, freaking God. Go to bed! You're tired! You're tired. Ugh. How do I Lord make Lord Ariados publishes a hashtag that is a lie. Let's see. Kamoko is gaslighting me. Did he say you're cute? Is that why? Let's see. Wooden cross, wooden grave face. Okay, that's my next thing I need. And to get that, I need five green points. And to get the green Kaylin points... Kalen says you should use an energy potion, but at the same time, like, we kind of want to push the calendar so the bishop comes by sooner, right? Do we? I not really once thought about that. Because once it's at a level, the bishop will approve the True. shit. Although I'm mainly going to sleep because I'm just hastening... Like, I I'm keeping my energy potion for emergencies. Kind of thing, you know? I mean, since we're here, like I said, there doesn't seem to be a time limit. and I mean, I still haven't pooped in like three weeks, and that's not pleasant. All this poop in my purple pants. Okay. It is raining. Do we have a body? We do not have a body. You take your pants off and your legs are just brown. But since I've been working with the dead all day, no one really even notices any difference. Done. Okay. So, do I have any stone repair kits? I don't think I have any, right? Yeah, I don't have any stone repair kits. Okay, no problem. So this body has... is pretty good. Let's see if they're... That one's pretty sinful. That one's pretty sinful. Ooh, that one's very sinful. That one's a holy body. This one is... I don't know what the 72 is. Is that because it took me so long to get the body? It degraded that much? Ew. Okay, well, I've basically figured out sort of what we're doing. What is this? Great. This area is closed due to the ancient curse. Please address any qu concerns to the Inquisitor. Oh, hey, maybe we can ask him what's going on then. Huh. And this is how we can expand our graveyard eventually. Whoa, that is a lot of green bits. Awesome, so now we can buy simple gravestones. And I can make a... That's like the second time quote number 19's been deleted. I can make a... a stone headstone at the stone cutter. I just use the word 
stone three times in the same sentence. So let's go ahead and make that, because I haven't done that yet. That's one of the reasons why I bought so many nails. Okay, so stone cutter. I need four flitches. Luckily, I have one log left. This game is super crazy fun. I could totally see putting on a podcast or just a YouTube video that I don't have to pay full attention to and play the shit out of this. Uh, oh. Boop. Okay, go here. Stone cutter. Sure, we'll stick it here. Tenergy says the great quote war has begun. <laughs> uh, let's build that. Thank you, Kalo. Okay. Iron ore can be... What? Oh, no, then there's other shit I can do. Add gravestone. Oh, I only need cut stone for that! That's awesome, because that's easy to get. Hell yes! Okay. Let's, uh, let's take this over there and... How about we help out the, uh, holy body? Because there's that one body that has... very high potential. I wonder if I can at least get the materials back from destroying a headstone. So where's our holy body? Right here. Okay, so let's destroy the marker. Yes, and I get it back. Awesome! Okay, and then we add the stone one. Yes! Okay, and that gave us two... That gave us a total of, um... Uh, I think one total point. So, if we replace this one with, oh, I wonder if I can't go any higher with this one. Like, this would be a body to exhume because we can't really do anything here. So, what I need to do is start upgrading all my headstones. Like that one. And that one. So I just need cut stone. Okay. Oh, man. Oh, this game. <sighs> we all know she's cute, Rooker. What is with the quote war you're having in the chat right now? I don't know, but it's distracting the chat, and I'm putting a stop to it. Sorry, guys. Oh. Okay. All right. Just like people are adding quotes saying I'm cute and I'm deleting them. And we're adding quotes and deleting them and adding Whoa. quotes and then deleting them. And it's like, no more. Didn't even see that. Okay, got some stone. Let's see if I can get... Yeah, that's enough for two. Oh, Kayla man, that's says, awesome. hashtag enemy reinforcements. <laughs> All right. Oh, this game is seriously calming. Okay, so then we go to the stone cutter... We'll craft two gravestones, but I can't do it because I'm too tired. And so I set the work order, and now I'm going to go to sleep for a couple days. <sighs> this is what I kind of wanted out of Punch Club. And the reason I bring it up again, it's the same publisher. It's not... I don't know if it's the same developer, but I know it's the same publisher, and they are graphically very similar. Pulling up the quote list is exclamation Make point sure quote list, right? Make sure to... Yes. It's uh, exclamation mark quote space list. Oh, quote space list. Yes, not just quote list. Okay, so doop a doop a do. There we go. Doop a doop a doop a doop a do. Okay. Stone repair kits. Thank you, Ryu. How do I make those? Not there. Stone repair kits. So I do have the right to make them. I need <laughs> iron parts and clay. All right. That we are short on. But that's a good thing to have because that's part of the problem. Like some of the stone bits are... Oh, shit, a body. Oh, god damn it. God damn it. How do I... Damn it. Do I kick it in? How do I... I've made the hatch. What do I do with the hatch? Can you... What? Damn it! Oh, I guess we'll just go in. 
I wonder what the hatch does then. Mortuary desk. I need metal bits. That's something else I need to work on. Ah. Uh. Lord Ariados is bemoaning the loss of the cute Sean quotes. You're not allowed to make them anymore. Cosmic could... Phoenix says your body goes in the hatch once you retire. KG Friends does stop throwing corpses. <laughs> that funny. person has loved ones. Not anymore. Now they're just a pile of meat and right. bones. I'm just going to stick that right there for a second. All right. So, grave wow, that thing is versus quality. I mean, again, it's not my fault that I just left it out in the rain. Or something. Yeah, get that shit in there. Okay. Cool. I can use that to buy some clay. Meanwhile, let's... Make a gravestone. Right, so we're gonna remove that one. Oh, you can see there's sin bits there. Yes, and then we'll add the that. We'll add the that. Boop. And that gave me a positive one. Okay. Dang. Maybe that is how I have to bribe Snake. Maybe I need five whatevers from doing the church thing. Oh, man, this is hard work. We don't have a name for this guy, do we? He's nameless. He, he kind of looks like a Scott to me. Yeah, but Scott's a dick. I mean, this guy's kind of a dick. Did Pyro post, post the preview link? No, I don't know what the link is until I make the, like, I, I'm not going to make Cosmic the stream Phoenix until we're says, ready. says, not our problem. There are no pollution laws. Exactly. This is the world of, of libertarianism. I just heard a bunch of jingling. Does that mean, yup, okay, cool. Like, goddamn, freaking! Can you put the bodies in the hatch and then they'll stay there? I, I don't know. I don't know what the hatch is for. I just heard a bunch of jingling and then, like... Uh, it just occurred to me, I should... Oh, he loses part of his, um... His... I guess, morality... He loses a part of his morality when I chop up a body piece. So that's why I shouldn't always do that. Make sense? Yes. All right, let's... Oh, God Fucking... <laughs> oh, I'm the worst gravekeeper. All right, so then we go here, and then we'll add another this. Quality two. And then I was we'll gonna say slap a marker down for that poor guy. This. Yeah, it doesn't matter. Quality three. Cool. Alright, let's let's add a few more grave sites, which is part of my problem here. Okay. Now just diggy diggy some holes, which is one of my favorite things you diggy, say. Diggy diggy hole, diggy diggy hole. Diggy diggy hole, diggy diggy hole. Oh shit, but that damages the quality. Because now there's just a giant ass hole in the ground. Oh a man. A preview of coming attractions. Yeah, really. Uh, alright, I guess let's just add a bunch of grave sites. Oh shit, Tets, man. There's this weird delay and lag that's going on on my end. So we can at least plan out our graveyard. I wonder if I can destroy... Yeah, I can. Good. Let's remove that. I have to work on it. Okay. Because just adding a grave spot doesn't seem to mess with my... What? Stop. <laughs> just adding a grave spot doesn't affect my quality, which makes sense. You're just like, this is where bodies will go. Okay. I am learning the system. Cool. All right. I mean... I guess, again, there's KJ nothing more to do. friend says weird teenagers are going to go on dates here. Make it look nice. <laughs> oh, yeah. Ryu, just, Ryu was the one telling me not to dig them out. Unfortunately, I did not catch that in time. 
Um, oh, Pyro or Sean, please scroll up to see the comment on the hatch. There's a body hatch in the morgue that needs to be repaired. Once that is done, the donkey will drop it into the hatch and it will be waiting for you in the morgue. Oh, okay. Um, let's do that because that will save it from, uh, that'll save the body from decomposing because that is affecting- Getting down to McDonald's quality? Yes. What happens when you run out of space in the graveyard? You make them into pies. Exactly. Or you chuck them in the river and wash them down to the town. Or you... Cremate them. Cremate them. Or probably give them to the one dude and say that they were witches. Uh, oh, shit. Now it is up here. What are you eating? Because it smells really good. Doritos. No. Oh, hashtag not sponsored. God damn it. Yep, Kalo and Ayla have to leave for the night. Bye! I'm, oh. Uh, okay, bye, Kalo. Alright, let's see. It is getting kind of late. Like, usually we try to wrap the main stream up by 5.30, which was an hour ago. But we also had an hour of bullshit I had to deal with. Okay, here we go. Fix the corp hatch, corpse hatch inside. I need four simple iron parts. I can get the stone easily enough, but not the... Ah, uh, Teddy Sprinkles. All right, I think we're going to be done for the day then, for now. This game is Herticult. fucking fascinating. Hi, Herticult. Thank you for joining the stream just as I start to uh, close it. So this, I guess this will be it. Again, just as a reminder, this game was given to me for free, and I'm glad because I was probably going to buy it anyway, but, you know, they saved me 20 bucks, which is great. And the game's super fun, so I'm I'm eager to play it some more. Ooh, each trunk and chest is its own thing. KJ friend is asking what kind of Doritos? Uh, American. Cool American. So... What? It's what they are in other parts of the world. Are you serious? Yep. Huh. Ranch is an American invention. Anyway, um... We'll just put shit in there. Oh, I can transfer money, too. Or something. Huh. Oh, and I can see my stone stockpiles for my inventory. That's cool. Oh, man. They have a lot of awesome little quality of life stuff in here, too. This is great, man. I'm going to just keep playing this game all night. Um, But now it is time to end the stream. For those of you who are watching live, again, you can go to Discord in a few minutes and see the link to the after party. And I'm not intentionally being secret. It's just I don't know where what the link is yet because I haven't made the stream. Um, but, uh, and then we can we can do what Ryu has wanted me to do for like four months and we are going to watch uh, we are going to watch um, me watch Dragon Ball Z abridged, which is weird. But, I mean, it's just weird to say. Um, so I'll be on face cam and all that. So, uh, if, if you're not a patron, uh, you may want to consider donating to Patreon. There's a link in the video description and you can name a stream for what you want me to do. Within reason. There is always veto power on my part. Um, but if you're watching this from the archive, I guess that'll do it. I am going to keep playing this game. I'm going to go out of my... And the thing is, sometimes I say I'm going to keep playing a game and I don't. And it's because I get distracted or something is too much for me to deal with. Or uh, what more commonly happens when I do early access games is that I don't play it for another year because they're still in early access and doing all the bugs and stuff. Um, but this game's out. You can buy this right now. It's the full release. So I'm going to keep playing the shit out of this uh, for realsies. And I'm going to have a lot of fun being a grave keeper or something yeah so that'll do it for today so if you're watching this from the archive thank you very much for watching and i will see you next week for another stream bye these burritos are so good they are i like ranch it's my favorite